What is up, everyone? I am Truex Norseman. Today, I'm going to be reviewing the Intercept Gaming Glasses by Gunner Optics. These things right here. Now, if you follow my YouTube channel, you've probably seen me wearing these the past few weeks on my videos. Um, this is because I suffer from major headaches and eyesore while using my computer for long periods of time. Now, recording, editing, editing, uploading, watching YouTube, and gaming all at once means that I spend tons of time on the computer and I get tons of headaches and eyesore. So, if you suffer from the same thing which you probably do if you're watching this video because you're considering buying gunners I'm gonna be going over whether or not you should get them along with some other things you need to know um, so anyways this is gonna be an honest review I am NOT sponsored by gunner in any way shape or form my YouTube channel is way too small for something like that so this is a seriously honest review just exactly how I feel etc etc so first things first uh, where you can get these and for how much these things cost uh, $60 to $70 depending on where you look. I believe I picked mine up at Walmart for $60. Um, I think you can find them in store as well, but I got mine on walmart.com. Uh, Amazon, they were $70. It just depends on where you look. You can find better deals depending on where you go. They come in many different colors. There's blue, black, gray, also known as onyx, I guess, um, green, red. Red's my favorite color, so I went with red. Um, now, Design-wise, how do they look? I personally, I like the design. I don't think there's anything wrong with the way that they look. But to be honest, I have had somebody make fun of me already. They're just palling around, make fun of me. But anyways, um, so not everybody thinks that they are the coolest looking glasses out there. But if you're not making YouTube videos like I do, it's not going to matter because you're just going to be in front of your own computer in your own house with nobody around you anyways. So I wouldn't worry too much about the design. But if you don't necessarily like the intercept design, there are many other designs out there. You can go check out on the Gunner's official website. Um, so yeah, that's design wise. Now comfort, um, they're a little tight to be honest, but I've got a big head, but the good thing about them being a little tight is there's no chance of them falling off. If I have to look down or look over or something like that, they're not going to fall off easily. Um, plus I've never been in discomfort because they've been too tight and I wear these for pretty much any time I come down to my computer now. I sit down on my computer, I'm working on something, I'm wearing these. Um, I very rarely go on my computer without using them at this point. Um, the only time I've ever run into comfort issues while wearing these is if you wear gaming headphones like this. So if you wear over-the-ear ear cuff headphones such as this, you are going to run into some issues. Now, if you're a big-time gamer, you probably are aware of this little thing called ear fatigue. Uh, which for me, I get my ear fatigue around two hours. Ear fatigue is when you wear your headphones for so long and that your ears just start to hurt from them. And it pretty much happens to everybody um, unless you got super comfortable headphones or something like that. What I've noticed is when I wear my glasses in pair with my headphones, I get my ear fatigue two times faster. So normally I get my ear fatigue around two hours, but with these on, I tend to get it around an hour, maybe even 40 minutes. Um, it's pretty quick ear fatigue when you're wearing these. The only workaround that I found to this issue is if you wear your glasses kind of funnily and kind of uncomfortably on your eyes um, is if you wear it over your headphones like this so that the um, the frames go over the cuffs uh, that's the only way to prevent the ear fatigue from happening faster it is a little bit uncomfortable on your eyes right here below your eyes because it is fully resting on those but it's not too bad it just looks a little bit ridiculous um, and if ear fatigue really isn't an issue for you, somehow you got the miracle of ear fatigue not being an issue, then I guess it doesn't matter too much to you. Uh, that's the only issue with the design slash comfort that I found so far is wearing it with headphones. Now, the cool thing about this is it comes with this nice case when you buy it, which is really nice. Uh, it's just a simple cloth case. Now, I thought it was microfiber, but I don't believe it is after doing a few things. Now, one thing you need to know about these glasses when you get them is that they smudge super easily. One of the reviews that I did see out there that I watched myself said and stressed uh, heavily that these will smudge and you will not be able to clean them unless you have a microfiber cleaning cloth along with glasses cleaning solution. Now, I'm going to definitely pack them up on that. I thought that they were just going, you know, they were exaggerating when they were saying that, but it's honestly the truth. These things smudge like crazy and you cannot get the smudges off. Even with the microfiber cleaning cloth, it's still difficult at times to get the smudges off of this thing. So when you get these, make sure you get the microfiber cleaning cloth and the cleaning solution. It will help tons from preventing the smudges and cleaning. So definitely do that. Now, do they work? 
As you guys know, as I said, I've been wearing these for about three weeks now. Um, when I originally wore them, the first two days, I did not see a difference. I was really upset. I thought that they didn't work. Um, but pretty much, I think that it's just because either my eyes needed to adjust them or it's because I had been on such a binge of using my computer that my headache still happened. So the first day I wore them, I still got my headache. The second day, I still had really bad eye pain but no headache. By the third day, um, it was pretty much that all that was gone. I haven't gotten a headache since wearing these. I do suffer from eye fatigue um, after wearing them, after being at my computer for long hours, but it definitely doubles the amount of time I can sit in front of my computer while wearing these. So they're definitely good in that aspect. They do get the job done. I don't know if it's because of the uh, orange lenses, which you can sort of see. You can't really tell on my camera, but they have sort of yellow slash orange lenses. They're supposed to make it clearer or easier to see your screen and see things sharper or something like that. Um, as far as that goes, I don't really think so. Um, what they do do, however, is I tend to squint when I look at my computer without the glasses. They stop me from squinting 100%. So when I wear these things, I no longer have to squint, which is amazing. So I guess I can see, see things sharper because of that, but definitely not because of the orange tint. Now, if you're wondering if the orange tint takes away from it or makes your screen look funnily cover, colored or anything like that, they actually don't, surprisingly. Um, I thought, you know, the le yellow lenses were going to make everything look really funky. They really don't. Um, they definitely, when you first put them on, you're going to notice a slight change in colors, but it really doesn't look different in the slightest at all. So do not worry about that. That is one thing I was definitely worried about when I got them. Um, I was also worried about whether they work or not. They definitely do prevent you from getting the headaches and they will let you last longer eye fatigue wise. So do I suggest these? I definitely do. I wish that they were cheaper, but they're not. Um, I think any glasses really would work. Uh, that don't magnify. I think it's just the fact of having a lens in front of your face. I don't. I really don't think that these gunners are like really specially designed to prevent headaches and eye fatigue. I just think that having something in front of your eyes helps. So I used to wear sunglasses in front of my um, in front of my computer, and uh, I used to be fine. Uh, the only reason I didn't continue doing that is because sunglasses look ridiculous on camera at your computer. Plus, they're too dark. Um, so really, you can pick up. Let's see. You can pick up like working glasses. I don't know what they're called, but I can wear. You can wear them at Airsoft, so you can find them at Airsoft stores and stuff like that. Yellow lens glasses um, that aren't gunners that are like fifteen dollars. You can get them in a range, a gun range. Um, I don't really know. I might put a picture up or something like that. I don't have any of the reference, but there are yellow glasses out there that are much cheaper. I can't vouch that they'll work because I've never tried it, but I have a feeling that they would. It would just be a protect protective barrier in front of your eyes, just like these are. And I think you'll get the same results, if not close to the same results using that. So definitely give it a shot before buying these because... Um, I think you can find a cheaper solution than Gunners. Although, if you're in it for them looking cool and, you know, you don't care about the price, definitely pick these things up. They're pretty sweet. Um, I definitely will continue to wear them whenever I use my computer for now on. So, thank you guys so much for watching this review. I know I'm not that great at reviews, but I would really appreciate if you hit that like button down below if you learned anything or if this helps you make your decision on whether or not to buy them. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope to see you guys in the next video. Till then, stay frosty and peace out.